Navigare nesetze est, vivere non est, have cried many sailing among the score or so of Paklani or Paklinski Islands, islets and rocks that fascinate the sailor with their strange rugged beauty. Don't let yourself be fooled by the name of the islands, which sounds like the word for hell in Croatian, because it really derives from the resin called Paklina, once used for caulking boats with. The closest to the port of Hva is Jerolim, the first in line, and it is largely filled with many day trippers from Hva who, in summer, have no truck with the textile industry. On the next one, however, called Marinkovac, the sailor comes into his own in the southern cove of Stipanska and in the lovely anchorage of Shdrilca on the northwest side of the island. But in the channels between them, and also between Planikovac and Borovac, one has to keep a sharp eye out for plus signs marking shoals. Now we've sailed as far as the largest of the Paklani Islands, Sveti Clement. There is one lovely bay after another on the southern side. In the first and most popular, Vinogradisce by name, you can anchor on a sandy bottom, bathe from a pebble beach, and then snack on sea eggs, scampi, and Havagregada in the Mengelo restaurant. The next two, Staristane and Tarsce, don't have any restaurants, and you can enjoy the peace and quiet in them, while the one after that, Solina, provides a good anchorage and a walk to the only habitation, Vlad. But sociable sailors can tie up in the most popular Dalmatian marina, Palmigiana, on the northern side of Sveti Clement, and walk along the pretty island paths with their garnishing of tropical vegetation. <laughs> 